All right, I'm gonna go over how to set up your contact page and full width pages. So let's dive right in and create a page. I'm gonna call this page full width example. Add in some just gibberish text and publish it. And this is just to show you, I'm gonna open a new tab, what the normal page looks like. The full width page just simply removes the sidebar to get that you just go under page attributes, template, and select full width, update it, and you will get your full width template. So um, let's go ahead and go and set up our contact page as well. Publish it. We're gonna select our contact page template. Update that and we'll view our page and again it won't look very different but um, the cool thing about this is how we create it what we can do to insert the map is insert a short code via this uh, short code generator and we can select a map and you can adjust all sorts of options like your location you can type in a full address or just a city like this example zoom in a lot or leave the zoom out and then you can adjust the height the width will automatically adjust as needed. The height is the only one you'll want to adjust, and you will get your map. Then the next thing to go over is how to add in the contact form. And this is really easy. You go to contact, and I have a couple examples that I've created, but by default you'll have contact form one. You can just copy that, paste that into your contact page and now you'll have your map and your form. And if you want to edit the contact form fields, you can do so here. There's documentation um, and links to the contact form seven if you want to adjust fields, add some, remove some, and your email address that receives. Um, it's all very simple and done there. And then if you want a full width contact page, you can use the contact page full width, refresh the page, and you'll get your contact form. So that's how to create those two pages.